Hey you, my name is Ruel Cadell and this is my vlog. I know that was really official and all that, but I'm just trying to get in the dig of things because it's been so long, months or a year, I don't know really. But I have a reason or I have a reason, a very good reason. I was serving my country. Doesn't count, no, okay. <laughs> the thing is, actually i have been posted to abia i was posted why am i speaking tony on your own english i was posted to abia to serve and well you know NYS is one year and all that so i was without my team and mm, i know i know vlogging has to do with consistency but we're not just consistent so i apologize and i promise to be better because i'm not doing this alone now yeah i am with fresh news tv this time so i've blown you understand you can't understand you have to blow to understand but <laughs> anyway 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 my name is Ruba Cadell. i had to say the name two times so to so you understand two times rural Cadell, and this is my vlog being Cadell. normally i just talk about issues that affect society and all that why well, try not to come off like a gossip even though what i really want to do is i'm a bore but you understand just i'm trying to package the armor ball and today something really uh, i'm going to talk about something that's really been bothering me so i was posted to abia state to serve i made a video on that on my blog yes i was posted to abia state to serve and it was kind of the transition was really I didn't really cope well at first. I learned a lot. I, I met lots of amazing people. Ah, Nigerians are awesome. Yes, I met amazing people. But I'm, I'm, I'm glad NYC is over. Although, in a stingy, greedy way, my 198 has stopped coming. I didn't believe it when it happened this month, really. I just happened in a month and I didn't get 19. But it's okay, I'm not complaining. I'm not angry. I'm not shouting. I moved to Abuja. Yes and no i'm not enjoying you're not allowed to say ah you're enjoying you're not you're not allowed to call me big girl and no you're not allowed to tell me to carry you along you you can't you can't do that you can't really because at first okay i'm not allowed to call brands but when i first came here i do know my way around and you know it has to get around so i was using a branded taxi you know you're safe and Let's just say my money are finished. So I was not henching KK and <laughs> bike. And today I found out that I have actually been taking a longer route down to the studio. Do you understand? It means that for a while now I have been taking longer routes literally everywhere when I could have just taken a straight KK. So no, don't tell me I'm enjoying anything. Just just don't say anything. Thank you very much. I'm not hungry. Like I always say, I'm not complaining. I'm not hungry. It's just that's not really my problem today. My problem today is the whole Oscar drama. Yes. Now, I'm not mad at the Oscars. I'm mad at Nigerians. Okay. I'm mad at Nigerians. And I'm Nigerian. Normally, I'm 80% Nigerian. Normally. Because there are too many issues that happen in this country. And I just don't want to be a part of it. But then sometimes when amazing things happen you know i'm like 100 percent nigerian and now the last time we heard something about this kind of a affiliation should i say affiliation sometimes english used to turn you on you but the last time we heard something about something like this was when um people said funky akindele or that there was news there was news or rumors i don't know i saw it and about funky akindele being part of the cast for black panther and I was 105% Nigerian and then like Nigeria to the world, all that kind. I was really excited. And then it turned out to not be true. So when I got to know about Genevieve, uh, I keep calling the movie Genevieve, sorry. Lionheart's nomination in the Oscars, I was, I was excited. I think, no, submission for nomination. You see this whole issue and the, the story behind this stuff is very, very tricky. But anyway, when I got to know about the link with the Oscar, I was I was excited. Like, you know, people like us, we don't we don't need to fly out to the Oscar. No, we have online TV. We watch it online. 
no need to go anywhere that's where we watch all the exclusive weddings watch everything i attended banky and adisoa's wedding you just don't know how so we watch everything online so i was getting ready like oh yeah oscars we we're going to the oscars everything and then when i wake up and yeah we've been disqualified so i was pissed i was pissed like are you playing with us are we a joke to you really and eventually it turned out that she or rather lionheart i keep calling this movie her movie i keep saying genevieve i keep saying she i know it's girl power and all but anyway and then eventually we found out that lionheart had been disqualified because it was predominantly in english now i was pissed i was i was angry i was really angry you can't you can't you can't do that to us you can't do that to me we're getting data ready to go to the oscars we're planning to we are at and then you're disqualifying it why and it's like wasn't this the whole idea behind being colonized like for us to speak english and all that and nigeria is big we have countless or well we can count them of course but you get my point when i say we have countless ethnic groups lots of languages we have three pardon me three major languages and all of a sudden because we didn't pick one and speak it throughout we are not doing it again so i decided not to be a typical nigerian you know a typical nigerian does the stuff where they read headlines no sorry we read headlines we do not read the body of the story we don't do that then we go ahead and ask somebody oh did you hear what happened and then the person goes oh mm, i think so from someone's thought we get our own thoughts so now there's a headline and there are countless thoughts none of which are usually associated with the story i used to be a chronic comment reader on on instagram okay so sometimes you see a storyline or rather you see a headline and the comments are entirely different or they will post the video and in in a minute there are like thousands of comments and when did you people watch a five minute video or when did you people go through the insta blog tv story or insta i don't understand how so yes we're guilty of that i decided not to be a typical nigerian at that point i decided to be 70 percent nigerian and well I, I want to say I, I made some research by actually just checked Google, which would actually solve most of our problems though. But anyway, I checked and I got to know that she had been the movie. I keep saying she. <laughs> the movie had been nominated for best international feature film. See how smart I sound. You should try Google. So it had been nominated for best international feature film, which was previously known as best foreign language film now this movie or rather this category is for any movie that was done or that had been done outside the u.s like nigeria obviously and had a predominant foreign language track yes that's how they put it predominant foreign language track so at that point when people were going all oh, i'm going to what line has again i'm going to this i'm going to that and all that most of us were just being really sentimental we're just being very very emotional and most of the approaches that i saw to this stuff eh, was just not all right like we started thinking look at me okay look at me i went all the way back to being colonized like it's not even that deep and also when i made more research i got to find out that the oscars had been on since 1929 so the Oscars, though they're not older than the first Nigerian movie, but really they're like older than us as a country. So I'm very sure that we are not their problem. I'm, I'm, I don't know much, but I'm really sure that we're not their problem. So looking at it like this, I just feel maybe this just wasn't our year. And I once heard a public speaker say, the Nigerian motto, the Nigerian dream, um, dream rather, is ego better. And... <laughs> We're always hoping, you know, that's, 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 that's what makes us Nigerians. So if we don't put on our data to watch Oscars next year, 2021, you go be, we're coming for it. You get it? <laughs> so um, what I'm just trying to put out to you is, I think we should calm down and read first or make research first. That's even amazing. Making research is not even that deep anymore. You don't necessarily have to sit down in the library and scroll through. Just type it. 
it's not even that serious just type it and eventually you get your facts straight and you won't be so angry anymore so next week i'm going to give you dates on moving the whole okay i've done a video on nyc experiment before so i don't think you want to hear that i'm even tired of talking about it anyway but moving and what people do not tell you about transitioning okay so until then my name is raw cadell this is being cadell <laughs> <laughs>